today we are going to see measurement uh, measurement today we are going to take measure okay shall you know what is measurement actually see measure man measure means quantity measure means quantity if you know the quantity it is not a measurement so we need the unit okay this measurement know the quantity of any objective or process or work that uh, any thing size everything we can i am telling some examples if you know the quantity means it is numerical quantity means numerical that means if you are example 50 this is also 50 this is also 50 this is also 50 this is 50 this is 50 like that see you will see now there is no difference this all 50 are same but you are going to put the unit the 50 will be changed for example 50 meter 50 meter means it is showing the length another now 50 kilogram see see the difference next one is 50 liter 50 second 50 centigrade 50 degree this degree is understand for angles 50 degree centigrade degree 100 degree like that this is angle see measurement means we know the attribute or process or anything that size and the which numerical plus units this is measurement now understand the measurement okay now we see the understand what is measurement measurement we can see the measurement into two systems one is british system another is metric system british system metric system we know that this british system and metric system basic units basic units and this another one is derived units what is basic units what is derived units basic units the first fundamental units for british system it is for f b s f means form feet e means form this is length this is pound pound for mass s yes means second this is for time this length for feet so british unit basic unit is for length feet for mass pound for second time for second okay the same thing here metric unit we see length mention for meter and mass mention for kilogram so time the same thing second actually this fundamental basic units for used in mechanics you you may be know another some fundamental basic units for uh, electrical system uh, that is voltage means volt current means amps ampere next voltage current 
frequency hertz so these types are for example light these all are parameters actually these all are voltage current frequency length mass time these all are parameters these all are units for the parameters these parameters how we know we know the instruments by the instruments we can see the these parameters uh, for light how to measure the intensity of light that is candle sound measurement of the sound or noise it is decibel so so many basic units are there what is derived unit derived units uh, multiply of this basic units for example c length means basic units but length into length length into length that is area length into length into length this is volume so like that the derived units are come uh, pressure um, power pressure stress this type of parameters are under the derived units so in this okay now we understand measurement and measurement basic unit and derived units actually measurement means we have uh, see three topics one is parameter next one is unit another one is what instruments used for know these units measurement tools are instruments and instruments okay what are the instruments required to see this units for example basic is measuring tape measuring tape another one is steel scale steel scale another one is these are linear measurements that mean linear means length breadth width like that so out side caliper inside caliper divider you know this these three are tools actually these three are not mention any measurements but measurement tape steel scales mm inches like that another one is vernier caliper ver ni ya vernier caliper this is vernier caliper is standard caliper also there another one uh, depth uh, height vernier caliper depth vernier caliper also there another one is micro meter micrometer this micrometer also outside micrometer inside micrometer depth vernier meter also there like that cages some slip some feeler gauge feeler gauge tapper gauge see feeler gauge is all uh, like a leaf the leaves are 0.05 mm like that but feeler gauge is also mm and uh, inches also that tapper gauge is a single gauge it is show all the measurements but the feeler gauge is used for uh, between gaps we can measure between the gaps tapper gauge and dial gauge another 
See, these cages are we can use for measurements and alignment like that. Okay, next one leveling for split level. This is split level is a one type of instrument. This is a inclination like that. Master level. Master level. This master level we can up to 0.02 mm per meter. Like uh, accuracy uh, inclination we can see this. This like water tube also. Water tube also one type of instrument. This is for uh, height tubers. We can see. Right. These are some instruments for in measurements. See, in this uh, topic measurement, we must know the parameter and the unit and what instruments we need to measure this. Okay. Measuring tape, steel scale, Outside caliper, inside caliper, divider, vernier caliper, vernier caliper, standard caliper, the same standard caliper we can measure the uh, ID, OD and depth. But uh, depth vernier also there, height vernier also there, micrometer, outside micrometer separate. This vernier least count is 0.02 mm. Vernier uh, micrometer least count is least count means uh, what is the lowest measurement? See, feeler gauge actually 0 0.05 mm to only this difference 0 0.02, uh, thickest one is 1 mm like that. Tapper gauge uh, 0 0.02, 1 mm. Uh, sorry, 7 mm like that. In the same gauge. Dial gauge is 0 to 10 mm, but this least count is 0 0.01 mm. Dial gauge. Street level is a rough figure for leveling, but master level is um, it is accurate than speed level. Water level also rough for height leveling. These are the instruments we must know for the uh, measuring tools and instruments. Okay.